What's good, everybody? Back once again. And we are finally done. Finals. No, and nothing intended there. But anyway, uh, it is over. It is done with. It took seven, seven of those games when it's like we would have thought that it might have gone seven until it went to 3 0. And then from there, it was like, there's no possible way. And it was. And then for us to get this sort of response or game from the Celtics is really more daunting. Uh, now, you know, you know, give credit what credit's due. I was like, Miami came up with the with the win. And I guess after the, like, uh, I was like, I was, you know, I had seen the thing where they already booked a trip to Denver. I'm like, oh, they, 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 come, they trying to come out. They, they trying to stunt. And that they did. Uh, this game really just seemed like who was going to really get hot. That's really that's really was because I was like it really was really struggle basketball for a, a good for a good portion of it. Uh, like there was spurts where it was just like where it was like oh, okay cool we had a good exchange of offense and then it was just like a dry spell where it was just like it just seemed like for for a while I think it was like uh, around that third quarter where it was just like. It's like couldn't get couldn't get buckets for either team for a while, um, we sort of like got in the Heat's favor just because they was up double digits and it never really ever got to a point where it's like it was. It, it, I think it got down to like maybe eight at one point, but then the Heat came back and found a response to it. Uh, the Celtics, I like granted Tatum hurt his ankle so early in the game that. One could think that maybe if he didn't, this would be an even closer game, considering the fact that he was really limited on what he does. And granted, how even though how his play style is, where he takes a bunch of threes and doesn't really go to the basket and stuff like that, you know, you can sort of get a different take on when it's sort of like elimination game or back against the wall or whatever you want to say. So therefore, you would have you could have thought that he would have gave he would have been the best version of Tatum that we know that he can be more so than not, not what this one is, but even where he's just like taking three to defense, ain't there, things like that. But yeah, no, uh, this was really, it was like, like Butler played, Butler played better than he's been playing the last couple of games. I feel like, uh, at the end of the last game in that fourth quarter, it sort of got whatever he, whatever he was going through, his, his mojo back or whatever, I feel like he got that sort of uh, going back again. He wasn't, you know, he wasn't Hemi. He wasn't Jimmy Buckets, you know. He wasn't on that level, but he sort of got back to, a, like, a little just a Jimmy Butler level. But there's always an unsung hero of the Heat, whether it's Vincent, Robinson, uh, Struess, I guess Lowry. I was like, they love ain't really played as much this series. High Smith, even though they it was a loss, him him having a good game last game. Tonight it was Caleb Barton doing stuff I did not know he was fully capable of. Like it not that he and not that scoring that amount. It was the way he was scoring. Cause it was it wasn't just spot up threes or or uh, you know, like easy buckets. Uh, to the middle. No, it was he. I mean, he was doing a lot of like fadeaway turnarounds and and uh, you know taking dudes off the dribble. And I I seen some I seen some people talk about like like how like his like uh, his shooting stroke is like. And I'm like, he got a clunky shooting stroke. That I don't. I'm like, it goes in. So hey, but it's a it's a hitch to it. It always gets me that the way not that it goes in, but an arc on it. But he was really that dude for him today when there really wasn't anyone else there outside of Butler. And that's sort of how it was also with the Celtics, where nobody really else came for the Celtics to play except for really Derek White. He he was the only one that really was keeping them in the game. And so for a while it was just White versus Martin for for the like the like a long stretch of time. But Butler is basically the added piece that got them over the top, considering the fact that Jalen Brown wasn't as wasn't what you needed for him to be, considering how Andrew Tatum was, and nobody and Smart didn't 
come up with much. Uh, Brogdon was coming back from injury, so you only can expect so much from him to play. Um, yeah, so it, it, it really just was, it really was just a struggle game and who just happened to have enough offense and that's that and the heat got that out. Um, yeah, I don't, I didn't think it was, it was, I was like, I, it just felt like the heat just sort of got back to what they was a little bit. I still didn't feel like it was full on heat, how it was like the three and no games or how they've been in some of the other series. It wasn't on that level. It, but also considering how the Celtics wasn't playing that it, it was, you could tell the difference in that as well too. Um, I didn't think the Celtic played like their. I mean, I was like the score looks bad, and they were, were down double digits a lot, and they were it was. But I was like, considering how everybody was shooting and playing bad, it wasn't like it wasn't how the Celtics normally just like give up and and just uh, like subside and all. It wasn't that. It wasn't on that level. It just it just wasn't going. It just wasn't hitting, and I, I was like, it's. It's somewhat. It, I mean, it's 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 sort of one of them things that like you work all this way back. So it's like one of them things that pe- I guess one of the people will say it was like like did they just run out of steam? Injury? Yes, the injury, um, the energy. I mean, um, did all that fade, or did this just end up being like a mixer of everything of like working all the way back? Shots wasn't falling. Uh, and just how the Celtics makeup is, where it's kind of like they sort of come to play. Um, I didn't really think they did uh, too many favorites because they also didn't really go inside a lot either. Um, and I'm just and I don't and I was like considering how how like they don't like Bam really the only dude they got to really be afraid of. And he was he was playing okay. That I would think that more. I was like go to the basket more or whatever like that. You know, I I, I was like, I don't know. Um, yeah, because I was like, it's several white. They wasn't also really hitting that from outside either. And that's sort of their go-to. And, yeah, no, it was just a struggle game. Um, but the, I was like, the Heat was able to take it. Um, I was like, I feel like they're going to be a whole debate of, like, Caleb Martin should have got the award over Jimmy Butler. And I'm kind of like, well... I get for the series he played more consistent, but the whole playoffs has been Jimmy, and then Jimmy did get him to a three and O start, and he played pretty good at the end of the fourth quarter, and he played good in this game. And I'm like, no, he gets the award. I'm like, let's like let's not be crazy here. He, I was like, he, I was like, he he was gonna get he was gonna get the award pretty much unless he was just god awful. Or something like that. Like if like it was Matt, it was like Martin Duncan and Struess won the game. Then maybe, but nah, he's gonna get the award. Um, yeah, so I was like, they got like a couple days before the Nuggets were sort of, you know, I was like Jimmy Bubble sort of grimacing in his game with his ankle, and it seemed like it would sort of be a good thing if you had a little bit more days to rest for the Nuggets, but they couldn't handle business until the day. Um, but. We'll see how that goes. We'll see how that series goes and whatnot. Um, but they can't play like this. They can't. They can't play like this if that's what they're gonna do. This was, I was like, on the heat level of games is probably like a C plus, B minus or something like that. This would be genuine of their potential of what they can do. But uh, really, was no X and O's and nothing like that crazy here. It was just really just like uh, brick is a make or miss league. We all hear that. Anyway, uh, that was my recap. If you liked any of what I said here, I appreciate it. Thanks. Um, If not, hey, maybe next time. But until then, peace. I'm out.